the resolution of the screen is technically the same also. So with that being said, how do the gaming actually stack up on this? Now in my testing, I played a couple of different games. Mario Kart 8, I tested Fire Emblem, I tested Bayonetta, and I also tested LEGO's Ninja Go movie, just to kind of see how good the performance is on this device. Needless to say, just like with its predecessor, the Switch Lite actually packs a pretty heavy punch in the gaming arena. It's pretty smooth, there's no real lag that's noticeable from the system itself, if, unless it's built into the actual game. Now with that being said, the only limitation that you have with the Switch Lite at this point is that it really can only play Nintendo Switch games. If you do have an account with Nintendo and you want to log into your online account, then you can start accessing some of the Super Nintendo games and Nintendo Classic games on this device like you would on a normal Nintendo Switch. That's a pretty good feature that you do have that backwards compatibility somewhat by accessing it online so that you can take those games with you on the go. Now, aside from that, there really isn't much else you can do in terms of gaming. That is